I miss you guys so, so much. I can feel all the love and the energy through this reading. It is truly a miracle to be back. So let's get into this reading. Um, I'm feeling like if you want to get straight into the reading, just check it out down below the timestamps. We have pile number one, pile number two, pile number three. <sighs> Welcome back. Breathe with me. Um, yeah, I'm so foolish girl. So we're going to do a pick a card reading today. I'm feeling guided more and more to do pick a card readings. Um, some of my personal clients actually like pick a card readings as well. So I thought it would be fun to kind of incorporate that here on YouTube rather than doing zodiac sign readings for the moment, guys. Okay, so um, just stay tuned. I'm not sure exactly what I'm do going to do because I'm doing what's led and hopefully you're doing what's led. So in light of this reading, this person is attracted to your goddess, god energy. Like your sex appeal, your sexiness, your vibe. That's what this person is attracted to. And that's what I'm being guided to share with you today from my spiritual guides, my angels, and the Elohim. Okay, so let's get into this pile number one. If you chose this citrine crystal, Someone's definitely traveling somewhere. We got the bus outside for pile number one. Tate. Mm. So, someone definitely wants to, they want to close a chapter out for you. Oh my goodness. This one right here. Okay, right away I'm getting you you are fine as hell. <laughs> like what are you doing? Where are you at? Okay. Um We have dates. This person wants to date you right away. This person, this is definitely someone new. If it's not someone new, it's like you're new to this person. You're just like brand new. Um, I feel the same way. We got the two of cups. Um, could be any sign, but I'm definitely getting Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, um, Taurus. Aries Leo Sag and yeah okay so the channel message I'm just gonna put the cards down um because this person is like flabbergasted Like, there's something with this high priestess energy here where it's like, is this person hiding something from me? Like, am I a side piece? <laughs> um, this person wants to say, I don't mind being put on hold. I don't mind. I don't mind waiting for you. But... I'm not going to be number two. I'm so, this person, I'm so worthy 
of all of your attention because I can give you with so many other women, men cannot give you. This is a manly man. This could be someone who works in like construction, um, a truck driver. Um, this person also could be a chef. Um, this could be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Doesn't have to be, but it could be any sign. This person could work in the travel industry. This person is an excellent communicator and they just feel like when it comes to you, you take this person's breath away. They want to serve you. Um, if this person is involved with anyone else, your goddess, god energy makes them literally, um, I'm hearing that song, uh, Usher, you make me want to leave the one I'm with. Like, you kind of have that vibe where yeah it's like you're worth waiting for whatever this person went through in the past it's like when they're with you and this is someone who is willing to share in a connection and in a relationship um let's get some more cards for and let's just see how they're feeling um and how like what is it about your goddess energy yeah Ooh. Um, you could be a Libra, you could be a Gemini. Um, it's just like, you know, you, you could be an Aquarius. You get over things so fast and yeah, they even feel like Sometimes you make this person feel like they're like they're put on the side. <laughs> like they like am I your side? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> am I the one who's on the side? Like what? Am I the one who's on the side here? Don't even try to play me out. Um Yeah, this person, um, they see you as someone who could really potentially break their heart. They feel like you could have them out here bad, like crying to their friends, you know, drunk texting. Your god, goddess energy. And I know that, I know I heard someone say like, oh, that's kind of toxic. But at the end of the day, it's like. This is a 3D reality that we live in. And I feel like you've been through a lot. If you've been through a lot, pile number one, let me know. Um, I feel like you've just been through so much and it's just like, yo, <laughs> back the you know what up. Um, there is something royal too about the way that you walk away from people, the way that you ignore them. This is the Four of Cups. So if you kind of like tell a person like, don't call me, I'll call you. If you kind of have that vibe, if you find that people approaching you might be a little bit shy or yeah, this person kind of maybe they, like, they drop things like around you. It's like because your vibrational frequency um, if they're not a match, if they're in four cups energy, if they're in lower vibrational frequencies, you will see the goodness in this person. You will still see the, the you know, um, you will still see the God in this person and you will tr still treat them with respect, but you know that you have to like keep things like separate. This person feels that way about you spiritually and in the natural world. That is so deep, like, oh my goodness. Um, some of you could be dealing with Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Doesn't have to be Aries, Leo, Sag. Um, let's just get a few more cards, like, to see what do they love about your, ooh, <laughs> we got cards. <laughs> oh my goodness. 
feel like this person like if you sing or um if you like are any type of mu musician or if you're into music or in art or creativity or if you're if you are an entrepreneur you know and you have your own business or you're like you know you're building your brand it's like you're really focused on your work you're not so much focused on love but you could be into this person and it could just be like I'm busy right now I have something going on or um, and maybe this person feels the same way I feel like there's great communication coming in I feel like yeah this is about to get long-winded so let's get <laughs> Okay, thanks. <laughs> Let's just get some advice about this person's next moves for pile number one. Let's get some psychic messages that want to come through about this person's next moves because that's what I'm all about. Let me know what's coming so you don't have to stress or press and you can continue to procreate your reality. Um, yeah, quality time. And hey, just be easy with this person. You might think that this person's not into you or this person's too busy for you. Um, oh dang, I'm hearing like, uh, no, that's the other way around. I don't know what's up with you and your person. There's definitely some, um, I guess mirroring going on right the both of you have your pride and your ego but it's like you're so cute together I feel like this person thinks about you in that way and I feel like this person is looking forward to getting to know you better and within those quiet like pillow talk moments okay because we have quality time and I love that okay so yeah you can expect this person to prioritize you and you can expect this person to be a good kisser if you haven't kissed this person this person want to kiss you they want to you know what I'm saying <laughs> make sure you, you make sure you have your you know your lips are feeling plush the next time you know you're gonna see them because they cannot stop thinking about you they're constantly thinking about you if you're thinking about this person this person could even be dreaming about you so if you feel like this person is playing you out thank you so much if you feel like this person is playing you out you are wrong um because yeah this person totally feels seduced by you so yeah that's all i have for you Pile number one, shout out to you and your goddess god energy. I will see you in your next reading. Namaste. Hi, pal two. If you chose this selenite one, um, I'm hearing it's electric I feel like your goddess energy is so high vibrational it's like people get tingles like they feel your energy when you walk into a room um, you could be famous or like in the limelight we got the six of wands we got the two of swords we got the queen of pentacles you could literally just like take take what you want choose what you want when you don't want it pick things up put them down even if you don't see yourself this way this is kind of how it's viewed and your goddess god energy is like it's just like people wait to wait like all you have to do is say hey babe and it's like people are freaking out over you. Um, your person is so attracted to this energy. You make people feel like, do they care about me? <sighs> Sometimes I wonder if you even care. It's like, is it over? 
are you going to give me a second chance? Literally, you could have people around you that like accidentally drop things. Um, <laughs> oh gosh, like, especially if you're like coming from pile one's energy, like this is some totally different energy that like I'm like tapped into. It's so chill, it's so calm and relaxed, you know, it's really choosy. It's like, you make people feel, you make people crave you, you make people want to be all around you yes thank you and you just you're like in this constant state of gratitude if this is not um who you are or how you are like this is how you're being seen it's like you are a walking spiritual awakening for a lot of people um especially the person that's on your mind like if you have someone on your mind that Maybe they're in a distant land or, you know, maybe this felt like <sighs> this person wasn't giving you like the energy or the vibe that you wanted. So maybe they kept you waiting. It's like this person. Yeah. Mm. You make people feel like. Someone is really singling in on you. So, because I am getting here with this Six of Wands. Um, this represents some sort of popularity. So, you might have a lot of people, like, or quite a few options. Um, especially if you're, like, in the public eye or people can see you or if you're on display in any way. Um, it's like, oh, you change, like, your, your presence. This reminds me of like Yogananda and how he was able to like, especially if you're in some sort of like spiritual healing um, industry or business or if you just have that effect. Some of you could have Mercury and Cancer, um, Cancer Pisces Scorpio coming through as well, um, but could be any sign. There is just something so nurturing and intuitive. So it's like when someone needs attention or yeah. Your goddess god energy is is highly intuitive and it's like you just know how to read a room and you kind of work the room and control the room like when you walk into a room and there is something about that here with um the six of wands and yeah so you can have a lot of um people feeling like especially one particular person in mind this could be someone from your past. This could definitely be an ex for some of you that like, it's like they just can't get over you. And it's like, they're like constantly like, let me have you, let me have you, let me have you. It's like, they don't know what to do. Um, they don't know what to do without you. Um, for some of you, okay, now I'm getting all these like specific messages, yeah. This person could have like a lot of pets or this person could be like really into like animals or they could kind of be for some of you this person could be hyper like um sexual in some sort of way um or they could have a high libido um yeah i'm definitely seeing that this person could also have quite a few options and but it's like mm, you're the one that they always seem to come back to or they will be this way about you because this is your, like your your goddess energy like this is you when you're at your best self let's grab some more tarot and see um i'm hearing i need a fast car so someone here like yeah they drive a really fast car or like ooh. Okay, why? All right. Okay, seriously, I'm definitely going to shuffle again. This is the Four of Cups. Um, some of you might be guided to watch pile number one. Mm, okay, so. Hmm. Yeah, this. <laughs> what are, are like? Not all of y'all are bougie. Yes, again, here we go with this choice energy. I was like, 
that four cups I was trying not to go there but that 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 was coming off as like some like kind of like you know side piece energy like they feel like they could easily just be a side piece with you and oh my goodness okay but the thing of it is mm, you might hide it really well like oh god people don't even care actually for some of you I'm getting some polyamor polyamorous um relationships um I don't know it's just like people don't even care they're like they see you, they could even worship you in some sort of way, and you could feel like me, I'm like so difficult to deal with, or like I'm constantly changing my mind, but they're not seeing you in that way. Okay, we got the lovers here. They definitely, they want to be your lover. They want to, there's a lot of pick me energy here too, because we do have the two of swords, and the lovers can also be about a choice, but this is much more spiritual. So this person feels like the divine chose you. So, you know, if you if you feel like, you know, maybe you're in some sort of high status, spiritual connection, or, you know, like this could be divine love. And it's just like, this person feels like you're the, you're their person. And it's like no one else is going to do. And um, yeah, if you like say, Ooh. Oh, yeah. You know, your energy is so youthful and lighthearted and so much fun that it's like that's what they feel like they need in their life. They feel like they need to talk to someone who, yeah, with your communication. Like, I don't know, maybe you are some sort of like motivational speaker or creative person maybe there's something you do creatively and it's like this person um they're attracted to that they feel like they they get outer body experiences when they look at your work like some sort of healing um <laughs> Oh my god, I can't believe how these cards are flying out. Okay, listen, someone is straight up obsessed with you. I, I'm not trying to freak you out. I'm not trying to scare you, but I did just get scared because look at these cards that fell out in my hands. That's why I love using, I love I love shuffling on camera um, so that you can see it, like you can see it for yourself. That's kind of crazy. That's that four of cups and that's that nine of physical. So like, listen, um... You're, you could have highly, like, sexual... You could be really attractive. Like, extremely attractive. Like, this is pre-Empress energy with the sign of pentacles in reverse. <laughs> this person... Yeah, I knew it. See, look what fell down. Look at that. Look at that. That's crazy. That's the Page of Swords. Some of you might be dealing with a stalker. I'm not even trying to... I'm not trying to play you. I don't know who you are. But I'm getting a headache from this energy, so I'm I'm about to pick up my cards. What the heck is going on? Oh, this is so freaky. I don't know. Just be careful with your accounts. Be careful with your energy. Um, yeah. So some of me like you're 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 like if you're not famous, if you're not in the limelight, if you don't have a lot of choices and options, um then yeah that's your energy in the future and it's powerful okay um if you're in that energy oh my goodness i'm just saying to you <sighs> oh my goodness let's move forward just be careful and watch your back because your in intuition is on point with this queen of cups energy i don't care if you're a masculine or a feminine energy um, I do not care you your intuition is usually on point and just protect your energy and guard your heart don't be so easy to don't be so quick to fall in love um, just because you might feel sort of isolated at moments or you feel like people don't get you I'm hearing that your person is is coming in and yeah this is exactly um the vibe that they're getting like how they're seeing you right 
right now let's get into this oh my goodness this is wow a lot so okay yeah you're definitely showing up as really strong empress energy um like it doesn't get any better than this you're the queen of all queens you're the king of all kings you're so nurturing you're so loving you're so thoughtful you're so considerate and for some of you they feel like your ideas are amazing are, are amazing um if you work in marketing i was trying to say <laughs> if you work in marketing or anything of the sort anything in the fashion industry like beauty um they just think like whatever you do how you look how you present yourself you're you're always new there's something always new uranus is coming through saturn is coming through venus is coming through okay let's see really strong gemini aquarius libra energy as well aries leo sagittarius your youthful spirit never change don't ever change like that fun and exciting part about you and what you can expect from this person is honestly you can expect for them to be lighthearted, but i do feel like you can also expect for some growth for some of you, you could be having a child with this person. I'm just telling you straight up. Now, if that's not the case, then this potential, like, you know, like my life started when I had you. This energy, it's like you've always been someone quite innocent and yet seductive. Yeah, because the daisies are giving me the sunflowers. Um, giving me innocence, you know, so with this childlike energy, so it's very seductive, but like in a way that you need to be careful, um, to trust your intuition. Don't be naive here with this child, all right? That's all I have for today pile number two namaste i'll see you in your next reading hi pile three if you chose this amethyst crystal this is your reading um what's really sticking out to me right away is i'm addicted to you are you a capricorn do you have capricorn in your chart are you dealing with the capricorn um do you have capricorn placements i'm addicted to you um this is some sort of like love obsession with this king of swords and i'm addicted to you um could be any sign could be any sign but right away what's coming through is gemini aquarius libra aries leo sag with this nine of wands taurus virgo capricorn with the king of pentacles yeah so with this king of swords and this a devil energy right here i'm addicted to you yeah this person oh gosh they just feel like you bring them to their knees you are the ultimate temptation um you really do get underneath the, uh you get underneath my skin you like i'm i'm never letting you go and even though you say no i know that you want it um this person has or whoever whatever listen this is strong sexual um prowess energy this is i want you and for some of you sunglasses could be significant um watching looking stalking gaslighting um this person could have just really put you through a lot um but it's like you flip that script on them 
and uh, they can't stop thinking about you with this cassette um your energy is devilishly <laughs> Um, uh, seductive. It's just like it's so tempting. You are so they cannot stop thinking about you. So who like this is the, this energy that you're in? I don't know. Like hopefully you're not out there trying to like do those little bootleg spells and stuff like that because like don't be trying to create nobody's reality. All right. Um. But yeah. We all have free will, but I'm just saying, even if you're not in that energy, um, it's like you just have some sort of <sighs> bitchiness. I'm, I'm just gonna say it like, no, like I said, no, and it's like that's so attractive your authority, and people love to serve you. It, be, it could be because of your intellect and for some of you I don't know I just want to say someone knows about something because I'm seeing here that there is a person in the background so it's like um Yeah, I guess they know that you know, you know what they're up to, um, and they can never ever fool you, and it doesn't matter, like, how powerful this person is, they still, like, it's like you still own, um, you still own the energy, you still own the room, and, like, um, yeah, people talk about you a lot, um, we got this cassette here, so... For some of you, this could be music or this could just be like, maybe you've been doing something for a really long time and it's like, you are, <laughs> just, you have this impression where it's like, you just make people think about you constantly and it's like, you don't even be thinking about you, thinking about people, okay, it's like you could be going through something and people are like taking things like personal and it's like, whatever, right? Um, you definitely, like, you handle jealousy so well. Ooh, my goodness. Like, whoever walks away from you, whoever turns you down, whoever, thank you so much, yes, whoever. It's like, ugh, powerful people, like, they're they're apologizing to you they they're, they're they're respecting you you get a lot of respect wherever you go because it's like yeah i can be sweet i can be humble i can be nice but at the end of the day like um still the answer is no there is something that is so desirable from the opposite sex when you're in that energy um i'm seeing some of you could have red hair i'm seeing that some of you could definitely um be in relationships and connections with people from all walks of life on the internet um also um there could be some age gaps here let's pull some tarot wow let, yeah let's see um, oh, how's your goddess? God energy, goddess, god, goddess energy. Yes, how's it affecting? Mm, oh, yeah. Um, if there's a third party situation, um, yeah, you might. You might really be over it. You might get over stuff real. You might get over things so fast that this person's not. They're not gonna be prepared for. Um, or you, you just be like, you know, middle finger, like, you know, what I'm saying, like, whatever. You, uh, uh, that's what I'm getting. And yeah, it's like, you could be in love one second and then 
all of a sudden it's like I'm out of love and I'm hearing that you know some people think that you are a narcissist or you're narcissistic but you're not you just have so much you've been through so so much you know and like yeah you could be really good with your hands and like you could just be you could have been through so much and it's like you know what no they love that you make people fall in love with you and want to be in a relationship with you with this three of wands yes aries leo sagittarius um taurus virgo capricorn um really strong leo energy as well so let's see let's get some more downloads yeah for some of you you could have met this person abroad or been in a long distance relationship with them and it could have really been on again off again and this person um Like, if you're actually in your higher self energy, you don't even know, like, how admirable you are. Um, there is this, um, there is this something to do with, maybe you speak multiple languages, maybe you, um, yeah, you travel a lot, you could be any zodiac sign but really strong leo aquarius scorpio and uh taurus energy coming through i feel like oh yeah like your food do you cook food for some of you maybe you're a really good cook or a good chef or you know about really good foods like you're just constantly in the know and mm, people wait for you they want to wait for you they wait for you they feel like you're worth the wait there's this excitement and there's also this luxury and this could be like people's subconscious thoughts because you might see yourself as someone who <laughs> kind of prefers to be alone but you know somehow like Three is always a crowd, and it's okay. You know how to handle them well. It's like you show up for the party, and you show up for people when they least expect it. Um, if there's been any confusion <clears throat> in this connection like if this person had like if they haven't been able to like speak up or speak clearly or there's been some blocks in communication because my my throat literally does not do that um someone could have like too much dairy or something like that um yeah i just feel like This person's gonna show up because you show up. You show up in the world. You show up as someone who cares, but when you come, your presence is felt. People remember you, okay? And I'm just curious to see, what is this person, like, what are they gonna do next? What can you expect? Some of you definitely need to check out pile number two. Maybe that's why I'm like, I'm kind of feeling guided to wrap this one up. Um, yeah, pile one, uh, this is a little bit different. You might, this one flew out in reverse. So pile one was different. It was upright. So I feel like, yeah, mm, this person might not tell you exactly how they feel. And there could be some sort of shame attached to how they're seeing and viewing your goddess god energy
literally this person can't get over you if this is an ex oh my goodness i hope it's an ex that you want to be with because if it's not it's it could be annoying for you so oh, just expect for some of you Oh jeez, you know, an annoying ex to kind of hoover around. I'm sorry. Let's just get some more. And let's see, like, any energy that's not from your ex, if you don't want to be dealing with your ex, for pile number two. What can you expect this new person to do? We got two cards. Oh my gosh. Ooh, this person's gonna be so sweet. Oh my gosh. Okay. If you get out of line with this person, they're gonna put you back in line. Um This is physical. This is just oh gosh. This is I hope that you know you drink a lot, some Gatorade. I hope that you're drinking some water. Um, I hope that you did your yoga. Like, I hope... <laughs> I hope that you are ready for this. I feel like this is something that you truly deserve with this judgment and this dominance, okay? This person is going to size you up and they're going to let you know that you are that Salisbury. You are that, um... That right zodiac sign, that the, whew, that right perfume, that your hair, like whatever is perfect. You drive this person crazy in a physical way. You know what I mean? Whoa. Like, okay. <laughs> I can't believe this is, like, this is actually happening. Like, you guys, are you ready for this? Because this person, they're, they might be hiding the fact that, like, they're going to put it down on you and they might not care who sees okay we do have people in the background here so yeah your 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 goddess god energy got got them losing their minds um i would just say take it easy on them let's see what's on the bottom of the deck oh transformation yeah Ooh. okay we got the butterflies um you already know yeah, you can make this person, you make people feel nervous and mm, it's like you love them and leave them. I'm done. I can't with you pile number two. Thanks for watching. <laughs> I will see you in your next reading. Namaste.